What's up guys, NVIDIA's upcoming GeForce RTX 4060 Ti custom graphics card from Palid have been listed by Russian distributor Marvel. The listing over at marvel.ru have been discovered by MomomoUS and lists down a total of four variants, all of which are custom models from Palid. The lineup includes the standard dual design which features a dual fan cooling system and the single fan Storm X design too. Both variants are listed in factory overclocked and reference variants. The addition of the Storm X series by Palit is exciting news as that means that ADA Lovelace will finally be available in mini ITX variants. The Storm X design, as stated above, features a dual slot and single fan design which comes in a very compact size with a small custom PCB. This design works great with the SFF build and we would love to see ITX options from other manufacturers too at the launch of the RTX 4060 Ti graphics card. But yes, it's gonna be just 8GB VRAM again which is ridiculous. 8 gigabytes forever. Yeah, if it was good enough for our fathers, it's good enough for our children. The NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4060 Ti is expected to utilize the AD106 350A1 GPU core, a cut-down version of the full AD106 graphics chip. And based on previous rumors, it should pack 34 SMs or 4352 CUDA cores and 8 gigabytes GDDR6 memory running at 18 gigabits per second across a 128-bit bus interface, providing the card with 288 gigabytes per second of bandwidth. There's also 32 megabytes of L2 cache on board the GPU, which is an 8x increase over the GeForce RTX 3060 Ti. The graphics card is expected to utilize the PG190 SKU361 PCB. Leaked PCB shots revealed that while the reference founder's edition makes use of the standard 60-pin 12VHPWR connector, the custom models will be free to use either standard 8-pin connectors or the newer 16-pin plugs. We've been told that it is much cheaper to just go with 8-pin connectors, so that should be the target as AIBs wants to maximize the production value of their designs. As for the TDP, the card will end up between 150 to 160 watts, which is around 25% lower than its predecessor, the RTX 3060 Ti. The NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4060 Ti is expected to launch by the end of this month with pricing close to $400 to $450. Guys, let me know in the comments below your thoughts about NVIDIA RTX 4060 Ti. Also, share this video with your friends. See you in the next one. Good luck to all.